Hey guys, welcome back to Installs and Pitfalls. Uh, today we're going to be checking out the mods that we did to kind of make this basic LE look quite a bit better, a little bit more premium, kind of look like a higher end car. One of our first installations that we took a video of was the Toyota mud flaps. These are OEM. We also have a comparison video with one that we had bought from Amazon. We ended up sending it back. It was just an inferior product. But we've been really happy with the Toyota mud flaps in the front and the rear. Our next modification that we did that makes it look really nice are these three inch nerf bars. We, uh, we've got a video on our channel of us installing these. Everybody that's <clears throat> installed those through our videos has been really happy with them. They really like them and they make the vehicle look way better. Swinging around up to the front, we're going to take a look at our lighting. So we added LED lights to the front. We did high and low beam on the headlights. And then also right here, this is your turn signal with these switchbacks that, that blink orange on and off. These will be your daytime running lights as well as the fog lights that we installed here. I'll show you that these go back and forth. So we've got videos on the installation of the headlights, low beam, and also your turn signal. Also, we, we added the fog lights down here. This is a daytime running light, and it also blinks orange when your turn signal is in. We added this tricolor Toyota badge, just kind of like an old school throwback. Um, that's pretty cool. We've got a video on that installation. We also installed these Factor 4 Raptor lights. Um, those are in a different location than the normal Raptor lights that you probably see. Um, I think it, it's a little bit cleaner look. Um, we also have a video of the installation on our channel. So originally whenever we ordered the car, we ordered it with the blackout package. So that came with black badges, black wheels, and I think the only chrome that was left on the car was this chrome strip that goes all the way back to here. So what we did, we really like the look of the XSE and the Prime that has the black roof. So we had the roof um, wrapped in black and they also did a chrome delete here on that window channel. So I brought everything together and there's no chrome left on the car. We also did a full ceramic window tint all the way around. It's 35% uh, on the front and then 20 around the rest of the vehicle, the back doors and the trunk. Um, that significantly lowers the heat that is transferring into the car. Another video that we did that we added these window vents. These have been great. They, um, they allow you to keep the window cracked, allow the heat to escape, and also provide a little bit of you know, ventilation in the car while you're driving. Those have been awesome. And around to the back, we also installed the LED lights for the reverse. The blinker, the brake light, um, and the running lights. We've got videos on all those on our channel. We'll link below as well. Um, and so it just it makes it look like it's a it's a really really expensive Rav4, just because it's got all the modern high end stuff added. So uh, check the links in the description. We thank you for watching. Uh, like, share, and subscribe. And We'll catch you on the next video. Thanks.